Good afternoon. Welcome to Heart and Day. Today, we are going to venture in the science world of Peperomia pilosida. In our dialect, we call it Sinao Sinao. In Tagalog, they call it Pansit Pansita. So we are going to forage around the house. And I will show you what does Pansit Pansita or Sinao Sinao looks like. Okay, here we go. Come with me. This way, please. Here, I found one. Uh, Sinao Sinao, or we called it Piperomia. They always grow anywhere, like nooks, walls, the cr cracks on the walls, sometimes on the floor, tiles, just outside your house, as long as the soil. Now, I found one here. It grows here. Look. This one. They have a uh, they have a heart shape, and they have like a flower as well, and then the stems are very soft. Uh, they can grow to one to one and a half feet, not that tall, but uh, they are very actually they are edible. The whole plant is edible. Okay, I'll just pick it up here. This is it. So I will pull it there, and you can see they're still small here. Okay, and here. So I'll just gather them next time. Okay, I have this one. This is peperomia. Actually, you can eat this raw or salad or concoction. There's so many, um, what do you call this? Uh, it can treat so many diseases, especially arthritis and gout. They say they have this uh, high in, uh, it can kill uric acid and also, um, you, if you are have a fever and a cough, this can help you as well. Okay, in some other countries, they use this one as well. Okay, so this is very um, important and this is also helpful. It looks like a weed, but actually in the Philippines, this is a medicinal plant. And it's very important and also it's a vegetable and a salad or for your salad as well. So, try to look at carefully. It's a heart shape, and it has like a small uh, stalks for like a soft green stalks. Try to check it out. If you want more de details, you can look at Wikipedia of uh, Peperomia pilosida. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye bye.